Here are some word problems in which there are equal groups of something. So some number of things that have the same number of something else in them. That's a little vague, but let's look at these problems and hopefully it'll become a little bit clearer. This one says, Billy eats about 935 calories of food at each meal. How many calories will he eat in four meals? So we have four meals that each have 935 calories in them. So those are your equal groups. The question is, how many total calories does he eat in those four meals? Well, since there are four of this thing, all we have to do is multiply this thing by four. So we have 935 times four, and that is 3,740. That's a lot of calories. Billy must be an athlete. All right, this next one says Chet spent $5.67 at the stationery store. If he bought seven pencils, how much did each pencil cost? So this is not exactly like the last one. It's, it's kind of the opposite. We have the total, and we want to divide that up into seven equal groups. And I hope you heard the word divide there because that's exactly what we're going to do. We have to take the total money he spent and divide it by seven, and that equals $0.81 or 81 cents, and that's how much each pencil cost. Kind of pricey pencils. This last one says, Amber spent $1.56 at the stationery store. That stationery store is busy. If she bought three bookmarks, how much did each bookmark cost? So we have the total amount she spent, and we have to divide it up between three bookmarks to find out what the cost of one of them is. So we take 156 and we divide it by three, and we get 52, or 0.52 actually, or 52 cents. So each bookmark costs 52 cents. And those are some problems about equal groups. You're always going to use either multiplication or division to solve those.